HBAR, yes, HBAR is up to 12 cents. It's up a 3x in the past year. Now, before you laugh, HBAR is one of my favorite cryptos to cover because it gets just as much hate, if not more hate, than XRP. And just like we say, I say it all the time, tokenomics are everything. Do I prefer more decentralized marketplaces? Do I prefer fair launch? Yes. But there's a reason why a crypto like Say has risen up tremendously in the past month. And there's a reason why HBAR is up a 3x. Even though many cryptos in the past year have soared many times past a 3x. This is the nature of buy and hold investing. Imagine if you were buying HBAR a year ago at 4 cents or in that 2022 bear market when it went below uh, 3 cents or around 3 cents. You're up a lot. Also, your risk is down to the floor. Literally, there's concrete floor because you'll probably never see a three cent H bar again unless the team goes, hey guys, we're gonna scam you. We're all gonna get arrested. And then H bar liquidity gets drained, which we're not gonna you know, see happen, hopefully. But that being said, let H bar be an example of a crypto that maybe doesn't look perfect on paper, but is pumping. Maybe not 100X, but it's still going up. You know, H bars a crypto I love covering because it's got a loyal community on one side, and then another side is like scam crypto. How could you be covering this? How could you be talking about it? Well, I actually told a Discord member in a voice chat. I referred her to uh, the Bitcoin to Hedera documentary. Now, before you ask, it is an old documentary. I wish they made an update on it, but they they go in depth with HBAR, the technology, what makes it different than blockchain, uh, the team. You see Lehman Baird, he talks. There's a lot of innovation with HBAR. And that's the main reason why I invested into it. Aside from the governing council, I like following where the money's going with the whales. I think the tech is very unique and I love investing in tech. I guess you can say I'm like a utility tech investor. And HBAR, it's only down a 4X from all time high, a 4X. That's hardly anything to really uh, lose sleep over. Some people will call anything more than a 3X, 2X down from all time high, a rug pull. And I'm like, okay, they're just hating. You know, I've been in this space now for a few years. A rug pull is not being down a 4X or a 5X. Hell, it's not even being down a 10X if we're in an actual bear market. But you know, people, like I say all the time, they don't have conviction or at the very least it's tested when you see that specific crypto down. And then as soon as it rises up, it's like, hey, John, is it too late? I love those questions. I mean, listen, I know you guys are new. You know, some of you are new. Some of you have been around for quite some time. Let HBAR be an example again, why you can't always listen to the FUD, the fear, uncertainty, and doubt. Because if you did listen to it, you missed out on some gains. Now, like I said, there's plenty of crypto that's going to pump. There's plenty of crypto that are pumping more than HBAR, but it's number 26 on coin market cap for a reason. People believe in it, despite what retail thinks. Also, it got listed on Coinbase in a bear market. It wasn't on Coinbase last bull market when it reached 50 cents. It is now on Coinbase. And just like uh, Art Block got listed on Coinbase way before this bull market even started, and pumped h bar is now in a position to pump it's not going to go as crazy as as art block is going to go as cycle but it's still going to pump you're still going to see people go oh look h bar it's cheap at 12 cents 15 cents 25 cents or even 50 cents or a dollar this cycle h bar never pumped from the listing but that was also when FTX was going down. We saw Terra Luna go down. So a lot of people were not trusting exchanges. And that was also when CZ, before he got you know arrested, was saying that uh, Coinbase was uh, going bankrupt. So there was so much FUD circulating the exchanges, not to mention crypto, that it, it would be very surprising if HBAR had pumped when it got listed. Now I've said before why I'm very bullish on HBAR, specifically their Hashgraph technology. Although I'm a big fan of blockchain, I understand that a lot of these blockchains, when they scale, sometimes their security gets compromised and sometimes the fees who transact on these ledgers increase. So maybe they're cheap initially, but then you see significant volume increase in these businesses and institutions that wanna transact millions of dollars, they increase their expense by doing so. HBAR has a fixed fee structure, which is very easy for businesses who wanna transact to migrate to.
because if they want to cut down on expenses and they want to do this at scale, the Hashgraph technology lets them do that. Also, I brought up before their gossip protocol, which is where their, their nodes disseminate information. They do it in a randomized manner versus blockchain. They do it in succession. So in blockchain's case, like Solana, which went down recently, if they get overloaded with bots or a shitty transaction comes through and they can't pass it through instantly, it can shut down the network with a lot of volume. Or in some cases, they have to fork the blockchain, which some ledgers have done. Hedera's case, by the time these uh, nodes receive the information, the transaction's already final. And they can do this at scale, also at a tenth or a thousandth of a penny of an H-bar, regardless of price. That is an incentive, a reason why the governing council is growing for one, and two, why I think adoption will take place for H-bar. I'm not saying it's going to be a top five crypto, it's going to overtake Bitcoin, etc. I'm not saying that whatsoever. I'm just saying as an investor, that's very hard to ignore let alone sleep on. I think Hedera, their technology is amazing. And the fact that they're carbon negative, they're green, they're scalable, they're not as secure as like a proof of work like Casper, but they do have a lot of good principles surrounding it. And although I'm more of a proof of work type crypto uh, preference as an investor, I understand cryptos like Hedera, they do appease some of these influencers who do want to see a green carbon negative crypto. So Hedera really checks a lot of boxes off. We're going to see in due time, you know, whether their tech actually gets more adoption. But nonetheless, I do see their governing council growing. The price is showing an increase. And being on Coinbase now in this bull cycle, it's going to be interesting to see where it goes. I still have it going to around $2 this bull cycle. I think at bare minimum, it's going to 10x from here. But I wouldn't be surprised if it hits 2 to 3 dollars a cycle i think two dollars is very conservative and also very possible for h bar this cycle and that would still be roughly a 20x from here which to me is a pretty good gain and by the way if you want to reach out to me talk to me zero crypto on buying selling trading be a part of a support group of like-minded investors who also want to change their life with massive profits we do voice chat hangouts every single week q a's we did one last night it was an awesome time if you want to be a part of this not be a lone wolf try to figure it out yourself stretch yourself out especially now during the bitcoin having when it takes place you're going to see real pumps if you're trying to be around like-minded people i highly encourage you guys to join the patreon and discord i'll leave a link in the pink comments down below anyways now i want to hear from you are you still holding h bar and if so where do you see its price as bull cycle drop your comment down below and let me know if you enjoyed this video please leave a like really helps so much that being said i hope you have a great day and i'll see you in the next one